Now, the full economic impact of this crisis won't be known for some time, but if unemployment skyrockets and people have trouble paying their mortgages, NBC6 reporter Tony Pipitone says a veteran of prior real estate downturns sees trouble ahead. If you were in Florida after 9-11 or the 2008 financial crisis, you know the negative impact an economic downturn can have on the real estate industry. And while the economic hit from this might be much worse, an attorney who specializes in real estate and foreclosure told us that there's no need for immediate panic. Uh, you're, you're looking at, at what effectively is the foreclosure crisis of 2008 but unfortunately on steroids. Attorney Roy Oppenheim has seen real estate crash before, but nothing like what might be coming. So it's a public health hazard this time, not just an economic issue. And that's why it's so much more complicated because it isn't just an economic crisis. It's also a public health crisis. What are we going to get hit with? We're going to get hit with um, rampant, rampant uh, folks who are going to be unemployed. I mean, the president's talking about 20%. If, 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 if it's 20% nationwide, it could be 25% down here. Something President Trump was asked about today. Is the government prepared um, to see this spike in unemployment? You know, worst case scenario, you would have terrible job numbers. If we can get this thing wrapped up and finished earlier, uh, things will go very nicely. But if they don't, Oppenheim sees some signs the damage will not be immediate. Uh, because they're not gonna get evicted. They're not going to get foreclosed during the next two months. And the reason they're not is you're going to have federal moratoriums. Eventually, though, a reckoning will occur. And, and we're going to see the same cycle. But this time, I hate to say it, but in some ways it could be worse. But in some days, ways when the cavalry really never came last time to support the little guy, like we're seeing this time, of all folks, this administration trying to do the right thing here. Just what it is able to do depends a lot on Congress. And Democrats and Republicans, like Senator Rick Scott, among others, say they want to deal with small businesses and workers and the unemployed, see they get help, before hundreds of billions of dollars may go to big corporations. Reporting in Miami Beach, Tony Pipitone, NBC6 News.